Hey, here's another PE game to use with your younger students. Kindergarten, first grade, I'm going to be using this one with today. This is uh, called Roll With It, and it's uh, adapted from uh, J.D. Hughes, author and PE teacher out of Georgia. So I just want to give him the credit here for this idea. Uh, I set up some hoops in the middle with uh, two different colored dice in each hoop. Uh, students will enter the gym and sit across from a partner, one person on each side of the hoop. They will have a face-off at the center. The face-off is just having each person drop the dice in the hoop or roll the dice. If it rolls out of the hoop, that's okay. We look to see, for, uh, to see which number is greater. Uh, whoever has the bigger number wins the face-off. Uh, if you have the smaller number, you lose the face-off, and both partners will have to leave the hoop and go and do something. If they win the face-off, the student that wins will run down to their half of the gym, and as you can see down there, there's a pink bucket, and that bucket is filled with Beanie Babies. If the person on this side of the gym wins, they run down to their bucket, which is down in that corner, also filled with Beanie Babies. They take one item out of the bucket, and they run it down across the gym to their uh, trash can there. They dump it in the, the big, large bucket there. And then they can run back to the center and have a face-off with another student. All right, same thing here is if this team wins, they grab their item out of the bucket and they run it across the gym to their large bucket and then they come back to the center for another face-off. If you lose the face-off here at the middle, you simply run back to your side where that cone is. You can see I've got a red cone there. So they will run around that cone and then run back to the middle and have a face-off. This team runs down to the blue cone down on that end of the gym and they will run back and have another face-off. So it, it teaches the kids uh, greater than, less than, and equal concepts, things that they're learning in math. So there's a little bit of a cross-curricular um, integration built into this activity. Um, so you can do it different ways. If the kids roll uh, the same number and they're equal, you can have them both go and take a uh, Beanie Baby out and put it in the bucket. Or, you know, you can have them roll till the tie is broken. Um, once the bucket is empty and all of the animals or objects, whatever you're playing with, are in the other bucket, then that team is finished, okay? And we'll play another round. So like the first round, we may play greater than, and if you have the bigger number, you win. Uh, the second round, we may play lesser than, and if you have the smaller number, you win. Um, so it gives the kids a lot of running around. If you put a pedometer on the kids and see their steps uh, in a 30-minute in a class, uh, most of them are getting between 1,500 to 1,000, uh, excuse me, 1,500 to 2,000 steps. Um, just a lot of running back and forth. And they want to hurry and get back to the middle so they can have another face-off and hopefully win another prize from the bucket and take it down and dump it in. They want to try and do that as quick as they can. And even when they lose, they have to hustle back to the cone so that they can get back in the game and have another face-off. So that one's called Roll With It or greater than, less than, equal. Uh, something to play with your kindergarten, first grade, maybe even second graders as well.